Welcome back to Z Coins today. We're diving deep into a fascinating coin that's turning heads in the numismatic world. The 1994 D Mint Mark I said dime coin. Yes, you heard that right. A coin worth just a dime, but fetching jaw dropping prices like $48,840 in the current market. Let's uncover why this tiny coin is such a big deal. To understand the value of the 1994 D dime, we need to start with its history. This coin was struck at the Denver Mint, indicated by the D Mint mark right below the date on the obverse side. The Denver Mint is known for producing billions of coins every year, including pennies, nickels, and dimes. In 1994 alone, millions of dimes were minted, making it seem like just another common year. But here's the twist. Some of these coins weren't your ordinary dimes. Mistakes during minting transformed them into rare treasures. These errors happened due to misaligned dies, incorrect planchets, or other production quirks. These rare anomalies often escape quality control, and they're exactly what collectors dream of finding. So what makes the 1994 D Mint Mark dime so special? Let's find out. The rarity of the 1994 D dime stems from a few factors. One of the key reasons is a die error that affected a small batch of coins. These dimes were accidentally struck on one cent planchets, the copper blanks typically used for pennies. That means this dime is slightly different in weight, composition, and color compared to a standard dime. Planchet error, struck on copper one cent blanks instead of dime blanks. Weight, weighs around 2.5 grams, like a penny, instead of 2.268 grams for standard dimes. Color, has a coppery hue rather than the silvery appearance of standard dimes. This mix-up is incredibly rare and makes the coin a standout among collectors. What's more, it's these kinds of errors that drive values through the roof. Now let's talk numbers. The 1994 D Mint Mark dime struck on a one cent planchet is worth far more than its face value. In a recent auction, one such coin fetched an astounding $48,840. Yes, that's right, nearly $50,000 for a single dime. But why such a high price? The value comes from its extreme rarity, demand among collectors, and the fact that error coins like this are virtually one of a kind. With only a handful known to exist, these coins are highly sought after in the numismatic community. So how can you tell if you have one of these rare 1994 D dimes in your collection? Here's a quick checklist. Look for the D mint mark. Check just below the year 1994 on the obverse side. Check the weight. Use a precise scale. It should weigh around 2.5 grams. Examine the color. Does it look coppery like a penny instead of silvery? Inspect with a magnifier. Look for any inconsistencies in the strike or lettering dot. If your coin checks all these boxes, you might just have a small fortune in your hands. As more collectors hunt for error coins, the value of the 1994 D Mint Mark dime could rise even higher in the future. Error coins are a unique niche in the hobby and the intrigue surrounding them only grows over time. Who knows? This coin might break even more records at future auctions. Before you go, here are a few tips to maximize your coin collecting journey. Always check your change. You never know when a rare coin could show up. Invest in a magnifier and scale. These tools are essential for identifying rare coins. Join numismatic communities, forums, Facebook groups, and local clubs can help you learn and connect with other enthusiasts. Authenticate your coins. If you think you've found a rare one, have it professionally graded to confirm its authenticity. We're diving into the fascinating story of the 1973 Mint Mark I cent dime that's currently valued at a whopping $58,840. Whether you're a seasoned coin collector or just getting started, this story is sure to blow your mind. Let's get started. To understand the value of this coin, we need to go back to 1973. That year, the United States Mint was cranking out coins like never before. 
the production of dimes, quarters, and pennies was in full swing to meet public demand. However, during this time, an unusual error occurred, one that would go unnoticed for years, but eventually make this dime worth a small fortune. So what exactly makes this coin so valuable? Well, it all boils down to a rare mint mark error. For most coins, the mint mark indicates where the coin was made, Philadelphia, no mint mark, Denver D, or San Francisco S. However, this 1973 dime has a strange twist. It was accidentally struck with the design of a penny. This error is known as a misstrike or die clash, and it's incredibly rare. This happens when the wrong dies, used to stamp the coin's design, are paired during production. In this case, a penny die left its mark on a dime, resulting in a highly unusual hybrid coin. These types of errors are often considered treasures in the world of coin collecting. You're probably wondering, why is this coin valued at nearly $60,000? Here's the deal. Coin collectors love rarity. The fewer examples of a coin that exist, the more valuable it becomes. As of today, only a handful of these 1973 mint mark error dimes are known to exist. Combine that with the fact that this coin is in excellent condition, and you've got a perfect storm for a high-value collectible. Hashtag hashtag the coin's value also depends on its grading. A higher grade, like mint state 65 or above, means the coin is almost flawless. The one recently valued at $58,840 was professionally graded and authenticated, which added to its market appeal. Hashtag hashtag now, here's the fun part. You might have one of these coins hiding in plain sight. When you're sorting through your change or an old coin collection, here's what you should look for. Inspect the mint mark area. Errors like these may have faint or unusual markings. Die clash signs. Look for unusual designs or overlaps that shouldn't be on a regular dime. Pro tip. Use a magnifying glass or a coin microscope to inspect closely. So is now a good time to sell if you've got one? Absolutely. The coin market is hotter than ever, with collectors paying top dollar for rare finds. Auction houses like Heritage Auctions and online marketplaces are buzzing with activity. If you've got a verified 1973 mint mark error coin, you're looking at a potential payday of over $50,000, or even more if demand spikes. And even if you don't find a 1973 dime, there are tons of other rare coins out there worth hunting for. Collecting coins can be as rewarding as it is profitable. Who knew a small dime could pack such a big punch? The story of the 1973 Mint Mark 1 cent dime is a reminder of just how exciting coin collecting can be. So, start searching your change jars, visit flea markets, and keep your eyes peeled. You never know when you might stumble upon a treasure worth thousands. We're uncovering an incredible story, the 2004 P Mint Mark 1 cent dime coin. That's right. A coin that's worth just 10 cents could be worth as much as $40,840 today. So what makes this coin so special? And why is it fetching such a jaw-dropping price on the market? Let's dive in. First, let's talk about the basics. The 2004 P dime was minted in Philadelphia, as denoted by the P mint mark. In terms of design, it features President Franklin D. Roosevelt on the obverse side, which has been standard since 1946, commemorating his role in founding the March of Dimes. The reverse features a torch, olive branch, and oak branch, symbols of liberty, peace, and strength. But what makes this coin stand out from millions of other dimes minted in 2004? Well, this particular dime isn't just any ordinary coin. It's a minting error a rare specimen where the characteristics or production process went slightly wrong, creating a one-of-a-kind collectible. Error coins are some of the most sought-after treasures in numismatics. There are many types of mint errors, like double dies, off-centering, or incorrect planchets. For the 2004 P dime, 
Some examples were struck on a one-set planchet. Instead of being made from a dime's typical cupernickel alloy, these rare dimes were accidentally struck on the copper-plated zinc blanks meant for pennies. This mismatch results in a smaller, thinner coin with a unique coloration that immediately catches the eye of sharp collectors. Check this out. A normal dime weighs 2.27 grams, while the error dime struck on a one-set planchet weighs only about 2.5 grams. That small detail could mean the difference between a coin worth pocket change and one worth tens of thousands of dollars. Now, let's talk about market value. In recent years, error coins like the 2004 P dime have been fetching extraordinary prices at auction. The most notable sale? A pristine 2004 P dime struck on a penny planchet sold for a whopping $40,840. Yes, you heard that right. $40,840 for a dime. That's the power of rarity and demand in the world of coin collecting. So how can you tell if you've got one of these rare treasures? First, look at the size, color, and weight of your dime. If it seems off, weigh it using a sensitive scale. If it weighs closer to a penny's 2.5 grams and has the design of a dime, you might be holding something extraordinary. And of course, it's always a good idea to get your coin professionally graded and authenticated by experts like PeaceGS or NGC. These organizations will assign your coin a grade based on its condition, which plays a huge role in its value. A higher grade, like MS65 or MS66, can dramatically increase its worth. And trust me, Collectors are willing to pay a premium for coins in top condition. So why are collectors so crazy about coins like this? It's simple. Rarity and a good story. Error coins are unintentional pieces of history. They're proof that even in the highly controlled world of the U.S. Mint, mistakes happen. And when they do, they create unique items that collectors are willing to spend big bucks to own. We're diving into the incredible story of a seemingly ordinary coin that has left collectors and treasure hunters in awe. That's right, we're talking about the rare 2014 D Mint Mark I cent dime. Stick around, because by the end of this video, you'll know why this coin is worth a jaw dropping $34,840 on the current market. Let's jump right in. First, let's get the basics out of the way. The 2014 D dime was minted in Denver, and it bears the iconic D mint mark just below the torch on the reverse side. Over 2.5 billion dimes were produced in Denver that year, making it one of the most common coins in circulation. So what makes this particular dime worth thousands of dollars? It's not just about the year or the mint mark, it's about the error. You see, this coin was struck on a one-set planchet meaning the blank used for pennies instead of dimes. This is a major minting error, and it's incredibly rare. Let's rewind to 2014 at the Denver Mint. Imagine the chaos of a massive coin production line, with billions of coins being struck in rapid succession. Despite the rigorous quality control, mistakes happen. In this case, a penny blank, or planchet, found its way into the press mint for dimes. When the press struck the planchet with a dime design, an error coin was born. Minting errors like these are rare because they're usually caught and destroyed before leaving the facility. But every now and then, one slips through the cracks, creating a treasure for collectors. Now let's talk value. Why is this error worth so much money? It all comes down to rarity, demand, and condition. This coin is one of only a handful known to exist. The error is so unusual that it stands out even among other mint mistakes. Collectors go wild for error coins because they tell a fascinating story of how the mint process can go awry. This particular dime is especially intriguing because it's struck on a penny blank, blending two iconic coins. The value of any coin depends heavily on its condition graded on a scale from 1 to 70. 
The highest grade for this coin currently stands at MS65, mint state, making it a pristine specimen. One of the key identifiers of this error is its copper color, which is typical for pennies, and its smaller size compared to a regular dime. Combine this with the Denver Mint's D mark, and you've got a winner. In 2023, a pristine example of the 2014 D dime struck on a penny blank was sold at auction for a staggering $34,840. Can you believe it? This sale set a new record for this type of mint error. The intense bidding war was fueled by top collectors who knew just how rare and special this coin is. So, if you ever come across a coin that doesn't quite look right, don't dismiss it as pocket change. It could be your ticket to a small fortune. Okay, so you're wondering how to check if you have one of these rare gems. Here's what to look for. Check below the torch on the reverse side. If it has a D, you're off to a good start. Unlike normal dimes, this error coin has the copper color typical of pennies. A normal dime weighs 2.27 grams, while this error coin weighs 2.5 grams, the same as a penny. Look for slight distortions in the design, especially near the edges, due to the mismatch between the penny blank and dime die. Right now, the market value for these error coins ranges from $15,000 to $35,000, depending on the condition and demand. If you think you have one, Get it authenticated and graded by a reputable service like PCGS or NGC. Once graded, you can sell it at major auction houses like Heritage Auctions or online platforms such as eBay. And remember, don't clean the coin. Cleaning can significantly reduce its value. Who would have thought that a tiny mistake at the U.S. Mint could turn an ordinary dime into a collector's dream worth tens of thousands of dollars? The 2014 D-Mint Mark I cent dime is proof that treasure really can be found in your pocket change. We're diving deep into the fascinating story of the 2015 D-Mint Mark dime. By the end of this video, you'll know why it's so valuable, how to identify one, and its current market worth. Let's get started. The 2015 D-Dime is a relatively modern coin, minted at the Denver Mint, hence the D-Mint mark. While most dimes from this year are just worth their face value of 10 cents, a select few have gained incredible attention in the numismatic world for their rarity and uniqueness. Hashtag he Denver Mint has been producing coins for over a century, and it's known for its high-quality minting. But even the best mints aren't immune to rare errors, and that's where the story of the 2015 D-Dime takes an interesting turn. So what's so special about this dime? Let's break it down. Error coins. The 2015 D dime in question has an error or anomaly that makes it stand out. This could be a die clash, double die, or a unique misprint. High grade. Coins that are graded by professional grading companies like PCGS or NGC at Mint State, MS, 68 or higher are incredibly rare and desirable. Low population. The number of dimes with these errors in pristine condition is extremely low, increasing their value significantly. Demand among collectors. Numismatics love coins with a story, and this one has all the elements of a perfect collectible, rarity, history, and a high grade. Condition. Visual. Show a graded 2015 D dime in a protective PCGS slab with MS68. Highlighted point one of these coins. Graded MS-68 by PCGS, recently fetched a staggering $16,840 at auction. Can you believe it? From 10 cents to a five-figure sum. All right, so how do you know if you have a 2015 D-Dime worth thousands? Here's what to look for. Check the date and mint mark. Make sure it says 2015 and has a small D on the reverse side, indicating it's from the Denver Mint inspect for errors, look for doubling on the letters or numbers, unusual marks, or off-center strikes, get it graded. If you think your coin looks unusual or is in mint condition, send it to a professional grading service 
like PCGS or NGC for evaluation. Visual. A magnifying glass over a 2015D dime. Even if your dime doesn't have an error, it could still be worth more than face value if it's in exceptional condition. Now, let's talk about the current market value. As of today, the most pristine examples of the 2015D dime have sold for as much as $16,840, but not every coin will reach that amount. Common 2015D dimes are still worth 10 cents. Mint state examples can fetch between $10 to $200 error coins, or those graded MS68 and above are where the big money is. Sometimes selling for $5,000, $10,000, or even $16,840. Cutaway to footage of a coin auction with an auctioneer calling out prices. If you're thinking about starting your own coin collection or hunting for valuable dimes, here are some tips. Check your change. Don't underestimate the power of pocket change. Your next Starbucks run could be hiding a treasure. Invest in tools. A good magnifying glass. Coin guidebook and protective holders are must-haves for any collector. Stay updated. Follow auction sites and coin forums to learn about trending coins and current market values. Background music builds up, showing coins spinning into a treasure chest. We're talking about a small but mighty coin that's creating a buzz among collectors. The 2017 P Mint Mark Dime. Yes, this tiny coin could be worth a fortune, with some selling for as much as $27,840. Stick around as we uncover its history, why it's so valuable, and how you can find one of these gems yourself. Let's dive into the background of this unassuming coin. The 2017 P Dime holds a special place in U.S. coinage history. To celebrate the 225th anniversary of the United States Mint, Coins from the Philadelphia Mint in 2017 were marked with a P Mint mark for the very first time on Lincoln pennies. But wait, what about dimes? Well, the P Mint mark has been a staple on dimes for decades, but it's the unique combination of minting errors and pristine conditions that makes some 2017 P dimes extraordinarily valuable. So, what makes the 2017 P dime worth more than just 10 cents? It all comes down to rarity and condition. Here's what you need to look out for. Mint errors. Coins with errors, like double die strikes, off-center strikes, or die cracks are highly sought after by collectors. These rare imperfections can skyrocket a coin's value. High grade condition. A coin graded MS68 or higher by a professional grading service like PCGS or NGC can fetch thousands of dollars. In fact, one of these dimes in near-perfect condition sold for a whopping $27,840 at auction. Can you imagine? A dime from your pocket change selling for nearly 28 grand. The record-setting coin was graded as MS68 with a full torch designation meaning its design details were flawless and highly detailed. That level of perfection is incredibly rare, which is why collectors were willing to pay top dollar for it. Now, here's how you can inspect your coins to see if you've struck gold, or rather, silver. First, grab a magnifying glass or a jeweler's loop. Look closely at the P Mint mark and other details on the coin, like Roosevelt's face and the torch on the reverse side. Any signs of doubling, cracks, or unusual features? Bingo, you might have a mint error coin. Next, check the condition. If your coin looks pristine, no scratches, nowhere, it's time to consider getting it professionally graded. Trust me, it's worth the investment if the coin turns out to be a high-grade rarity. The value of 2017 P dimes has been climbing steadily in the collector's market. While most dimes in circulated condition are worth their face value, uncirculated coins or error coins can sell for anywhere between $5 to thousands of dollars. And with more collectors entering the market, demand and prices are expected to grow. So what are you waiting for? 
Check your piggy banks, pocket change, and coin jars. Who knows? You might already have one of these valuable 2017 P dimes just waiting to be discovered. If you do find one, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear your story and maybe even feature it in an upcoming video. We're diving into the fascinating world of numismatics, uncovering the story behind the 2019 P mint mark dime. That's right, a dime that could be worth over $22,000. How is that even possible? Stick around as we explore the history, the mystery, and the current market value of this incredible coin. You won't want to miss this. Let's start with the basics. The 2019 dime with a P mint mark was produced at the Philadelphia Mint, one of the primary U.S. mint facilities. For those who may not know, the mint mark P is a small letter that indicates the coin's origin, in this case, Philadelphia. The Roosevelt dime design has been around since 1946, featuring President Franklin D. Roosevelt to commemorate his work in founding the March of Dimes during the fight against polio. By 2019, the design remained largely unchanged, but the story of this dime is far from ordinary. So what makes the 2019 P dime so valuable? A dime is just 10 cents, right? Wrong! This specific coin has garnered attention due to a few factors. First off, rarity plays a big role. While millions of 2019 P dimes were minted, only a handful have achieved perfect grades. Coin grading is done on a scale from 1 to 70, and a 70, called Mint State 70, MS 70, represents a flawless coin. Collectors will pay top dollar for perfection. In addition, some 2019 P dimes have unique errors or anomalies, such as missed strikes or doubling on the lettering. These rare errors make the coin even more desirable to collectors. And then, there's the demand. The numismatic world has been buzzing about this coin, which has driven prices sky high. Imagine finding a coin in your pocket change that's worth thousands. All right, here's the part you've been waiting for. How much is the 2019 P dime actually worth today? As of now, a perfect MS70 grade 2019 P dime has sold at auction for a jaw-dropping $22,840. Yes, you heard that right. But remember, this value applies only to the rarest and most pristine examples. If you find a 2019 P dime in average condition, it might only be worth its face value, 10 cents. However, even a coin with minor errors or a high grade below MS70 could still fetch hundreds or thousands of dollars. Now, let's talk about how you can identify if your 2019 P dime is worth a fortune. Here are some tips. Look for the small P on the coin, located just above the date on the front. Without it, you're looking at a different dime. Coins with minimal scratches, no wear, and sharp details are more likely to get a high grade. Use a magnifying glass to spot doubling on the text or any other anomalies, like misaligned dies. If you think you've got a gem, consider sending it to a professional grading service like Peace GS or NGC. This can authenticate the coin and determine its value. So what's next for this remarkable coin? With the numismatic market always changing, the value of a 2019 P dime could rise even higher in the future. Coins like this are not just currency. They're pieces of history and art rolled into one. 